All right, so this is a suggestion via donation. Uh, the name of the uh, video is uh, Why Bill Burr and His Wife Argue About Elvis. Listen, if you guys are new here, please like and subscribe. The more that you like this content, the more that I know that you specifically would like to see more of this specific type of content, okay? Um, let's go ahead and just jump into this immediately. Um, let me go ahead and try to guess why they're arguing about Elvis. Um, I know that his wife is uh, a deeply melanated person uh, in America, um, and I know her reasonings most likely why she does not like Elvis um, because it's pretty much a consensus around uh, the community of deep, deeply melanated people in America um, that they just do not like Elvis because of various reasons, right? Um, but um, all right, let's see where this goes. Let's see where this takes uh, us, guys. Now, I love Elvis, okay? He fascinates me. Right. He's like the first rock star with the... Like, I personally think Elvis, Elvis sang well, right? Um, was it original? No. But did he sing it? Did he sing the way he sung very well? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He was great. Power at television. They just intersected, and he went to this, this, he ascended to this level of fame that no one had ever been to before. Right. Hence, he made all the mistakes because there was no one there to help him out. <laughs> right? He got a piece of shit manager that stole from him. Bam! He stopped making music, started making shitty movies. He's not a good actor, right? Does that. <laughs> married a minor, started doing drugs, got fat, got an entourage, got even fatter, started- Whoa, 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 married a minor? Um, I don't know, I don't really have no idea about his life story. I think I've heard uh, maybe four songs from Elvis ever, right? Um, but the ones I've heard have been great, right? Um, but he, he married a minor? Married a minor, started doing drugs, got Christ. fat, got an entourage, got even fatter, started wearing onesies, doing karate kits, <laughs> splitting his fucking pants, Nobody's saying shit. You look good, King. You like that? You like when my royal balls hang out? We love right. it, King. Keep fucking going. R right. Starts doing pills. Gets addicted. He fucking dies alone on a toilet. All right? This man kicked open wow. all of those fucking doors for the rest of us. Right. All right? Right. So I sit down, and I'm watching this documentary as a white dude, which is what I am. I'm right. looking out my white head, watching this white shit. It's coming back into my white eyes, getting whiter by the fucking second. Okay. <laughs> right? Now, my wife, on the other hand, she's black, right? Now, I hate saying that because it makes it seem like I'm going to start doing some stupid comparison jokes. You know, those dumb white guy, black guy jokes. And you know, it's always like the white guy's like, oh, Jesus, I got I to gotta do my taxes. Can this chair hold me? <laughs> the black guy's always like, you need to loosen up. You got to relax, man. You just got to let it happen. All right? <laughs> it's always the same stupid fucking joke. I hate those jokes. Right. Because you know, they're easy. And it's been my experience that it's just not true. You know, 15 years of being with her, there's really no difference. You know, because at the end of the day, it's a woman. <laughs> all right. Basically, yeah. Like, I've been with, like, all types of women, guys. Well, absolutely. Uh, this probably not a not a country. <laughs> guys i've been i've been with a, i've been with, for the most part the reason why i'm saying this is because like i've been with like a lot of different cultures right and without a doubt they're pretty much the same pretty much no 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 they're the same guys right <laughs> let's get it guys you know 15 years of being with her there's really no difference you know because at yep. the end of the day it's a woman right it's gonna be the same fights. I don't give a fuck oh. who you're with. Right, right. I'm not gonna lie to you. There might be more head movement and hand <laughs> gestures with different races of women. Possibly an index finger right. jabbing at your forehead, whatever the fuck that is. <laughs> but at the end of the day, it's the same fights. What's going on with us? Do you need to work on this? Why don't we communicate better, right? <laughs> so she starts watching this shit as a black person, right? Right. And she's seen all the racism, obviously, that I'm seeing. But she was catching all this subtle shit that I was too white to see. But I knew I was missing it because right. I just kept hearing her huffing and puffing. Just sitting next to me being like... <laughs> 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 and I'm just sitting there like, okay, somebody did something. I don't know what just happened, but I don't think that was good. Right. So right when I, right when I didn't think it could get any worse... <laughs> could get any more uncomfortable between the two of us this fucking white dude comes on who evidently discovered elvis right and he's like a hundred and fucking 90 years oh. old oh. and he comes out starts talking he's just like well uh basically 
Uh, I was looking for a white boy that could take the down and dirty, nasty blues and combine it with the pristine, angelic sounds of bluegrass. And see, that's the, the exact thing that he's stating right now is the reason why a lot of, and I mean a lot, a lot, I would say almost 98%, right, of, of deeply melanated people will not, will not listen to Elvis. Yeah, that's what he was a doing. Lot. He was subtly putting black shit down here while he was propping up the white shit. You know, the down and dirty, daddy not sticking around, drug infested neighborhood blues <laughs> with the Jesus as white as me, hair the color of the sun, angelic bluegrass playing music, right? So at this point, my wife has like fucking steam coming out of her ears. <laughs> so I make a judgment call. I, ju right. I just fucking shut it off, right? Too she late. She looks at me. She's like, why did you shut that off? Too late. Why did you shut it off? I was like, because you're about three minutes away from yelling at me like I produced this music. <laughs> <laughs> Most right? likely. It was coming, just, bro. Just, just it was coming. Forget it. We'll watch something else. She's like, no, why can't we just watch the rest of this and then discuss it? Don't turn it back on, bro. Don't turn it back on. Afterwards. It's like, it's, I, don't, I don't fucking do that. <laughs> I just want to watch a documentary. I don't want to have a fucking lecture. Because of these fucking assholes, I didn't do anything. I'm just, I'm just sitting there watching TV. And not to mention, we're just, we're just going to get into an argument. She's like, yeah. well, why would we get into an argument? I'm like, ugh. All right, you know why? Because not for nothing, there was some black people in there saying some shit that I didn't agree with. You know? I'm not huffing and puffing. Yeah. I said that. Like a fucking idiot. And she just looks at me. She's like, like what black people? Like what black people have said what? <laughs> at that point, it's like you started the luge, right? You can't get off the fucking sled. Right. Now you gotta have the argument. I'm like, ah, fuck, happen, here we bro. go. Guess what happened this? And I'm like, all right. All right, the black guy who brought up leg shaking, saying Elvis took leg shaking from us. It's like, really? Leg shaking? No, nobody thought to, 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 to fucking do this. <laughs> black people came up with that. You're telling me that? I'll even give you that. Let's say you came up with that, but where did that black dude learn how to do it? Didn't he watch some older black guy do it? But what, because he's the same color? He, he, he's not stealing, he's just carrying on the tradition. That's the hypocrisy. Good call, bro, you pointed it out. But if Elvis does it, oh, oh, what the fuck? Now he's the biggest thief ever? That doesn't make any sense to me. She goes, no, you idiot. It's not about the leg shaking, okay? It's, it's about, he appropriated a culture. He took all the music, he got all the money, got all the fame, he's called the king of it now, and he never gave a shit, not even a shout out. I was like, all right. <laughs> Fair enough. You made about seven or eight good points there that I can't refute. <laughs> oh, people will try to refute this, bro. Trust me. He, he appropriated a culture. I get it. You're right. She goes, fine. Thank you. And I go, however. However. Not for nothing. Do I get mad at you when you get on a skateboard and you start going down the fucking street? Do I get all offended like, hey man, that's some white shit. Stop appropriating <laughs> my culture, man. Some dirty Another another good point, sir. Another good point. Well well played, sir. Well played. Well played. Call out hypocrisy when you when you see it, bro. Or hear it. My culture, man. Some dirty white kid in Santa Monica came up with that, man. <laughs> so she starts laughing. And I should have stopped there, but I'm a comedian. Oh. Right? I'm like, oh, I'm getting a laugh. There's got to be a bigger laugh. Oh, so keep go. going, Bill. No, no, no. Let's come with another example. So I'm like, yeah, do I get mad at you when you fly from L.A. to New York in under six hours? And she just, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she just stares at me. She's just like, that was fucked up. All right, guys. Listen, so now, now we have a little more insight into his uh, overall family life, right? Um he argues with his wife like everyone else argues with their wife that has the same skin tone as them, right? Um, life, guys, people are people. Once we get to that point in life where we understand that, you know, you may, for example, someone f born and raised in, I don't know, name some random town, guys, in Kansas, yes? Um, regardless of skin tone, you're going to have more in common with someone in that region, right? I would say, right? Uh, than someone else in, I don't know, Maine, maybe, guys. I guess the point that I'm trying to make here is that people are the same regardless of whatever, guys. The only difference is maybe culture, and culture can honestly change based on the county you live in, 
right? Um, you can have nothing in common with someone who lives in a different county in your state, guys. Nothing, really. You have nothing in common. You, you guys, like well, this guy here likes uh, living in a city, and you like living in a country, et cetera. Um, you really have not much in common. This is the reason, a lot of this is, a lot of this, um, that same reason is a reason why politically people have so many issues. Because they can't identify with each other, right? The, all, these, all the big cities are, are mostly one thing, while the country is generally the other thing, right? Um, this is why you guys can't, see each other's worldview enough to agree and uh, you, and every, everyone demonizes each other from both sides of the table guys right um, people are the same right we all we all kind of want the same thing you know we want to live we want to make enough money to take care of our family we want our kids to grow up healthy and safe right uh, and successful everyone wants that you know what I mean but all right listen let me know in the comments of the next thing uh, from him I should be listening to and I will get into that as soon as I possibly can all right listen guys you guys all have an amazing day and enjoy it thoroughly all right